Vancouver and our travel is 12 hours and now it's only one hour and a half so how many hours second stop of gas so yeah misa i think this is real month and yeah so we are having a gas and it's more expensive gas here so ayun. our last stop of gas we are less than four hours before we reach at my classmates house where we're staying for two nights so we're doing the last gas
Brunette Avenue. Actually, we're here. This is the gas station close to my classmate's house. And their gas is so shocking, guys. It's almost $2 per liter. It's dollar. How much? $97. Oh, yeah, yeah, I don't know that. Well, anyways, yeah. So, we arrived here at 8.40 p.m. BC time. Uh, 9.40 p.m. Alberta time. So thank God we're here now. Okay. So we're here now in British Columbia at the house of my high school classmates. So the reason why we're taking we're driving instead of flying, it's because when if we're flying it'll cost us like Three to five hundred dollars each back and forth to fly. So let's say it's four hundred dollars, that is eight hundred dollars for all of us. While we're, while we're us, if we're driving, even if we're uh, using, because we're using the truck, it'll cost us more gas. So our gas would cost us like five hundred or so, five, five, six hundred in back and forth. Then it's gonna be limited for our luggage because we're gonna take we're gonna fly. So well if we're driving we can take all we need. So and then on our way here from Alberta to British Columbia, there's a lot of good uh allowing good scenery. The mountains, you know, the Rocky Mountains of of between Alberta and British Columbia, they're really beautiful. That's why almost every year we go here, we drive. Yeah. Hey, Tico. Hello, Tico. This is their dog, Tico. Mm. He's so quiet. He's so quiet.